Network. Hi, this is Mark Isaac with the Garage Gurus. And today's tech tip is involving this 2014 Kia Soul. The owner uh, is complaining that the vehicle has a, a pull to the right when driving. So we put the tires at the proper inflation and we'll go drive the vehicle and verify the problem. Okay, we just got back from our test drive and we did confirm that it does pull to the right. As you can see from the video, uh, it's, it pulled from a dead stop. So when we you know, took off from a stop, you could see it starting to steer to the right. And uh, what we noticed, it was more pronounced at lower speed. So uh, it was basically the vehicle was, seems like it's steering to the right and we made correction and we had to constantly keep correcting it to keep it in a straight line. So uh, we brought it back in the shop, did a quick alignment check. Uh, the alignment numbers were in spec, nothing really indicating a pull based on alignment angles. And uh, so we decided to let's look at some other data. And uh, so we're gonna take a look at, you know, anything that has to do with the steering angle sensor. So we'll take a look at you know, our, our scan tool here and we'll pull up the module for electronic power steering. Go into data. And the steering wheel currently is in the straight ahead position. So uh, as we look at the, the data here, the thing that kind of jumps out at us first is with the steering wheel in the straight ahead position, we should be at zero degrees on steering angle sensor. And we see here that it's registering about uh, negative 52 degrees. And so Basically what's happening is this vehicle is trying to steer to zero. It's making a steering correction to the right. Uh, the negative number indicates, you know, the steering wheel is turning to the right off of center. When the number is positive, it's steering to the left off of center. Uh, it's trying to reach, it's trying to make this go to zero. So we're pretty convinced that this is the main reason why we're, why this vehicle is pulling because there's nothing indicating the pull from the, the tires, the tire pressure, or the alignment angles. So let's go through a steering angle sensor calibration and uh, we'll take it for another test drive. We'll go to system tests and we see steering angle sensor calibration. And reading through it says that uh, this is done anytime we replace the ECU uh, or if the steering angle sensor is out of calibration in the straight ahead position. Continue. Key on, engine on, ensure the engine is running. So we'll start the engine and then hit continue. Okay. Steering wheel has been steered to the straight ahead position. Continue. It says it's successful. Turn the key off. Go to continue. And it gives us a 30 second wait time. We'll be instructed to turn the key back on. Key is back on, exit. We'll look at our data. And we verify now that our steering angle sensor is at zero degrees. It's in the straight ahead position. And we'll take it for another test drive and verify that, the, that this should fix the pull. Okay, so as you can see by the video, we've cured this uh, steering pole with a steering angle sensor recalibration. Uh, if you like this tech tip, uh, be sure to uh, subscribe to our channel on YouTube. I'm Mark Isaac, and thank you for watching.